Welcome back, folks, to more Let's Play Blink the Bulb. In the last episode, we completed Loveland. Let's get that out of the way completely, to be honest. We're moving on to Terrorland. Is it a land full of land? Kind of, yes. Yes, there's a lot of land here. I guess they did it right. And there's also what looks like lava. I am going nowhere near that. And bins, trash cans, stuff. Okay, so that's an interesting enemy. And these these guys are at every bloody level. Go away. I'm sure the eyeballs turn up in most of the levels as well. Anyway, I believe this game. Oh God, what's that? A spring-loaded fish. Anyway, I believe this game harbors a very similar style to uh, Sonic games, being that, uh, well, top path is always good, and usually in platformers that are like this, I usually go top path anyway. It's awesome. But it's a passive item. That is a super seed. Plus one regeneration rate for special abilities. Okay. I have no idea what that means. Oh god, I... Yeah, that's the item I just got. It's an enemy. Great. Just murder this guy, and we'll just avoid him, just to make sure I do not get hit. And, oh, okay. Electricity fields. Nice touch. Nice touch, White Sparkle, nice touch. Right, okay, just a bit of sitting around doing nothing, but we're okay. Now we move on, oh, nice, a battery, we want that. Lovely weak batteries. That's that's I don't know what that was. That wasn't the eyeball. It was a thing. I killed it before it, I even knew what it was, but usually when it comes to games, that's a good thing. If you don't, then they may come along and kill you. Or at least damage you. Like that, pretty much. Thank you. It's also what it looks like. Like, I know. The pipes are being sick from the look of it. That is most certainly vomit. Oh god. Uh can I can I get through here? Yes I can. I have to shoot it. Okay. What the hell was that at the top that just randomly shot me? Use the other battery, we'll get us back to ten. And we might as well look like a wisp! Look at that. I have a giant I look like one of Mewtwo's Mega Evolutions, but green. I'm not sure if that's a good thing. Oh god. Oh wow, those guys are very short range, those robots. Ah, treasure. Another one of them. Okay. Um, I'll bite. Don't know what the hell they do, but I'll bite regardless. Alright, now how to get out of here? Um, hmm. Well, we can't get out that way, so... Got to go another way. I'm kind of lost here. I said I've, I've done the first two levels, so I don't know what to do here, so... Ah! Okay, it's over here, I'm guessing. Ah! You ass. I not like you and your standing still. Stop standing still. I hate it. Right, moving onwards. Let's get all this lovely here. Ooh. Ah, another battery! Nice! This is a charged one. I could use this when I'm on very low health. That's good for me! Hurrah for me! Huzzah, indeed. Didn't mean to rhyme, but no. And it's the trash cans again. They are dead. And more sparks. I'll just murder these weird fishes on springs here. I don't know what they're actually called. If anyone from uh, White Sparkle is actually watching this, do apologize if I get any of these wrong. I probably will. Here come the Yombies, though. Damn it, I still took a hit from him. I thought my Yombie would have killed him. Damn it. What are yombies? It's gotta be yombies. Ooh, there's a key down there. Can I get it? I kind of want that key. Yep, I can get that key. I want that key. I got that key. And anything Mastrath wants, Mastrath gets. Well, in video games at least. What was that? Ah, the solar panel again. Okay, that's not bad. Oh god, oh dub 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 dub. So when I charge up my energy, I can... I can't be hit by their energy blasts. Good to... That's what it was! You are... I can't kill him. Okay! I found an enemy I can't kill. 
there's bound to be a few in this game. There's bound to be a few in any platforming game. You know, Sonic had those weird spike balls. Um, in, no. Uh, ow. That is the weirdest conveyor belt. It's like it stops. It was like it stops you from moving because it's going that quick. I think you need to jump on it, I believe. Like, stay as far far away from the ground as possible kind of thing. Yeah, I'm gonna use my battery here. 7.2. Yeah, it didn't even fully charge me. Fully heal me. Not nice. I'm probably gonna die to the boss at this level. But this game has unlimited lives from what I from what I know. I believe it does. Um, I've lost I've lost a fair amount of lives in practice recordings and I haven't gamed over at all. Now I'll just jump on these to get rid of them. Ah, woof! Springfish! Double kill on the fish. Let's see what else we've got. We've got this! Yes, I want all the at you pain. Do not like you. I need a battery fairly quickly. No more, there's gonna be one in here. No, there isn't. It's another one of those head solar panel things. Okay, dokie. We will move on regardless, though, from the solar panel. Damn it. We will move on from the solar panel and fall. So we won't move on at all. We have, in fact, backtracked. We have to go back here again. Oh, yeah. Yep, platforming skills right here, folks. Platforming skills. You are dead, Mr. Angry Bin. Angry Bin, you have been defeated. We're up to 250 nearly. 250, uh. Right now. Ah, this is the boss. Yeah, this is the boss. Okay. So, here is our new boss. It's a television screen dash eyeball thing. And I just got hit. Right, so, we have the energy thing. That's my phone again. <laughs> anyway, we've got the energy ball. Uh. That's really all I'm seeing right now. Just avoid the energy ball and hit him in the face. And the conveyor belt, which is obviously annoying. I'm about to die. I've got 0.3 of a health. I'm dead. Oh, God. Anyway. We'll move on. Now we have 10 health. I should, I'll, I'll be able to beat him this time. Watch. I usually die one time on a boss here, but I don't die a second time. Ow. That's a new attack. He did not use that attack in the first time. In the first round. Also, those zombies, not the best. So we can't hit the ball. We can't hit the sides either because they also hurt. Yeah, the uh, the boss is certainly getting more uh, getting tougher. They're getting more tricky. Don't say that much. My zombies are dead, but now I get revenge on my zombies. Revenge on the zombies. Ha ha! Victory for us. Right, so now it's time for the night level, which is going to be. Ah, okay, yeah. This is a corrupted sparks level. Okay, occasionally collected sparks will attack me. Okay. I believe you will still get the sparks, which is good. But um, yeah, they will they will be feral and they will attack you and stuff. That's what it's saying. The moment it happens, I will show it, obviously, and I'll be like, hey, oh that there, there there it is, for example. There it is. Corrupted spark. Then he'll blow up into nine blobs of bollocks. But it doesn't matter. We have survived. So that'll happen sporadically. Every, I think it's randomized, some of that, but it's a very low chance of doing so. Oh, screw it, I'm just gonna go up here. Oh, now they fire crap at me. They fire green stuff. I can only assume that's toxic waste, to be honest. But then, that's just me. It could be something completely wrong. Oh god, I need to avoid that. Is it still following me? It's not. Good. Just blow that up. More toxic waste, I believe. For something called Terra Land, they're certainly not very good about the planets, are they? Let's be honest. It's like, ah, oh, this is Terra Land, and Latin for Earth is Terra. What's that? Glim goals. Ah, resistant to energy damage, finally! Finally we have gotten something to resist energy damage. Nice! That is very good. That is very good indeed. To be honest, when it comes to my passive stuff, I'd probably prefer all the resistance, because then, if I get too much, I think the resistance ones do stack. And uh, then, there you go. So I only took 1.8 damage there instead of 2 damage. It's not much, but if I keep getting them, like there, <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. That's another one. So now I should only take 1.6 damage. If I get enough of them, I become immune to energy. 
Which is great, especially with some bosses, I can just go crazy, just be like, ha, ha, you can't hit me, you can't kill me. I don't believe, thank you, I don't believe you can actually, uh, you know, just become invincible to a boss. I think, there's got to be a limit. There's got to be a limit to how much you can, uh, how much you can do that. Oh, key. Definitely want that. Yeah, there's got to be a limit. There's got to be a limit. So you, you should be like 0.2 is the, the, the final, the, like the limit of damage you can take. You know, you can't go below 0.2. You can't take like zero damage and be completely invincible against a certain enemy or boss. Wow. Did I just get two more? These gl gloam goggles? G-L-O-A-M. Gloam. Gloam. I'm going to go for gloam. It's not gloom because it's not double O. Mind. But uh, still. Oh god, it's another one. I'm just going to. Uh, oh, nope, just avoid you. There we go. I have noticed I am running out. I am running out of the good old sparks, and I do not like that very much. I don't like the fact I'm running out of sparks. Uh, there we go. We're okay for the moment. We're good for the moment. Right, just collect some sparks. Get out of the energy's rays. So the, the electric, I believe. Oh god, that, that's that's not nice. That's the first time you've actually been threatening. You are now dead. So now you are much less threatening. Another key. This is perfect. This is exactly what I wanted. Oh, nope. You're not getting me. You're getting me though. Cheers for that. Bloody palm tree. Damn palm trees. So palm tree panic and all that crap. Right, just wait. There we go, and move! Ah, another chest. Oh, it's not one of those bloody cone head things. I don't want them. Let's go into here. I don't know how we work under the water, to be honest. Oh, battery, that's exactly what I want. Thank you. Didn't even fully restore my health, but it got, it got close. There is electricity under this water. Also, I'm under this water and I'm powered by electricity. Wouldn't you think that I'd, sh thank you. Wouldn't you think that I'd short out? That's just me, though. That's that's just what I think. I I live in a world of physics, and when physics don't apply, I kind of go, eh? this makes no sense. But it, it is a game, so you know. I mean, every game is without its physics. Oh, I can kill a guy in a fighter jet, then jump out of the fighter jet, and uh, of my fighter jet, and then get into his fighter jet, all in one move. Yeah, that's physics. Bullshit, that's not physics. It's not physics. Try and do that in real life. I don't care if you're the best pilot in the world, you still wouldn't be able to do that. You have to be half pilot, half stuntman, half leprechaun to be lucky enough to get that right. Anyway, we'll just move on here. We've actually got 110 sparks. Well, 111, 112. Nice. So we've probably got enough for like three more uh, items, but then we're going to have to start going, hmm. I wonder if I can flog these. <laughs> but obviously, it's a game where you can't sell items. Yeah, that's a good one. That's a good DLC add-on. Um, White Sparkle. Have a sell option. Like, halfway through levels or whatever, or just like part of the way through levels, you come across like a shopkeeper. And you can sell your usables and stuff. That would be nice. Thing, I, I, I highly doubt they're going to do like any DLC add-on. This game feels very, com very complete as it is, so yeah. Another bloody... Also, so I don't have to keep getting those bleeding cone heads. That would be good as well. And it is random chance. Oh, more fish. Fish on springs. I don't actually know what they are, but they look like fish on springs. Ah! Here's the next boss. It's him. He summons fire. Okay, okay, this boss is automatically awesome. He summons fire. He summons balls of fire and rocks. Okay, this guy is mauling me. I'm dead. I always die on a boss. But uh, we will we will get we will get our head back and we will win. Because now we have ten health. I will tank your sorry ass. No, oh, it's not the best of things really, is it? Okay, so I can block energy damage, can't block fire though. That's just proof. Fire is overpowered in every game. You can't block fire. Fire is awesome. You could try and dodge fire, but that's about it. Ow. You could also have rock land right on your bald head. Twice. That's the thing about that, actually. Hold on a minute. 
I just had a rock drop on my head. I'm technically a bulb headed thing. So, when that shatter my bulb, I'm gonna die again, aren't I? No, I'm not. He's dead. Poor, close one. They are always close, though. If I was to learn how they work, I'd probably be able to do it no hits, but nah. Why not? You can do it regardless. Anyway, guys, I'm going to go for a break here, but in the next episode, let's play Blink the Bulb Frightland. I'll see you then.